So Bluehost and HostGator are two of the most recommended hosting companies in the WordPress space, and it's pretty clear why. They are both affordable and offer basic hosting for those who are just getting started with their website. But are they actually good? Is the low price worth the perceived lower value? And when is it appropriate to use either of these hosts? And which should you really use? Well, I'm going to be answering all of that and more in this video. But first, let's look at a few things. Pricing, features, performance, and reputation. So on pricing and features, both Bluehost and HostGator are pretty comparable and using the exclusive links in the description down below, for my viewers only, you can get either one at less than $3 a month if you sign up for 36 months up front. And three years of hosting for about $100 is a killer deal. Now I may get a small commission if you do use those links, but that does not affect the price that you pay and it enables me to keep making content just like this. So if you could use those links in the description, I would really, really appreciate that. So with both web hosts, you get one website, storage, unmetered or unrestricted bandwidth and free SSL. But there are two big areas where Bluehost wins out. One, they do include your domain with the plan, whereas with HostGator, you will need to pay an extra $15 per year for the domain. And two, Bluehost includes backups on all plans. So this alone makes Bluehost the winner for me here. Now, if we look at performance for both hosts, my own testing found that while both hosts do enjoy 99.9% .9 uptime, HostGator outperforms Bluehost in three key areas. One, loading WordPress and the lightweight theme. Two, loading WordPress and a multi-purpose feature-rich theme. And three, load impact testing as multiple people hit your website at the same time. So if performance is of the utmost importance to you, between the two, HostGator is the clear winner. So now let's look at their reputation. So with all that said so far, if we look at WordPress.org's own recommendations, only one of these hosts is there, and that is Bluehost. This recommendation, along with Bluehost being much more active in the WordPress community, shows a dedication to both the software and the people that we don't see with HostGator. But the truth is, if you ask 10 people for a hosting recommendation, you'll probably get 10 different answers. Everyone has their favorite and is probably just the one that they use themselves. The best thing you can do is think about what's most important to you. If cost savings is the most important thing, Bluehost just edges out HostGator because they do include a free domain for the first year. Similarly, if you think backup should always be included, Bluehost is the one you should go with. Now, if you believe in best performance at the lowest price, HostGator very clearly wins over Bluehost. And finally, if you want someone visible in the WordPress community and recommended by WordPress.org, once again, Bluehost wins. So you might be wondering, what would I do myself? Well, truth be told, having built and run numerous websites using both web hosts, I generally find myself using HostGator most of the time. But that's only because performance is one of the most important aspects of a web host, in my opinion. And like I said earlier, HostGator does usually have better performance. But it is up to you to decide what you're looking for from your web host and find what's best for you and your business. So while Bluehost and HostGator offers the most affordable options in the space, you'll need to weigh that against your ultimate goal, what you can afford and what features are most important to you. So thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more content just like this. And if you do have any questions about HostGator, Bluehost, or any other web host platform out there, 
please drop a comment down below and I will help you to the best of my knowledge. And as I mentioned earlier, please use the exclusive links in the description down below. They're exclusive for my viewers only, and you can get either one of these web posts for less than $3 per month. Now, I will earn an affiliate commission for using these links, but it's going to be at no extra cost to you. So I would really, really appreciate it if you fancy any of these web posts to use those links down below there. That's going to allow me to make even more content just like this. So yeah, thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.